All right, guys, it's a brand new day. RJ and I, we feel like LAers. <laughs> Actually, we feel more like vampires awake in the night. So we woke up early this afternoon, woke up at three, and now we're hungry. So we're looking for our breakfast, but like everyone's dinner time. And guys, look at the food place we found. Hey guys, welcome to my daily vlogs. Please subscribe. Baja Fresh Mexican Grill. Oh man, this already looks delicious. Just looking at the logo. Guys, it says no microwaves, no can openers, no freezers, no lard, no MSG. <gasps> wow, that's a lot of no. Although I disagree with this, but let's move on. Guys, check out all the different like salsas they have here. Wow, okay, I want the Baja, it's medium. Then they've got hot over here, medium to mild. And they've got the best herb ever. Cilantro, it's the best. We have friends here, by the way. It's the best herb ever, it belongs on everything in life. So I'm gonna get that. And then I'm also gonna get the Baja. <laughs> oh my god. Look at how much food there is. <gasps> RJ, is this correct? No, this is yours, taquitos, right? Are you sure? Yeah. Yours is what? That monster. Okay. But we share anyways. Oh yeah, I ordered black beans. Oh my, there is so much food here. Oh my gosh. The US does not play with their serving size. Oh, wow. Guys, I'm dying. The food, look at this food. I need to take my jacket off for this. Okay, so I guess these are my tortilla shells, flour. They're, they make them here, unreal. Okay, by the way guys, if you're new to the vlogs, welcome to the channel. Today's gonna be a food vlog. Be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this vlog and hit the subscribe button and join the Mobile Mind Squad. We will be your daily dose of positive vibes online. That's right, okay, and we're making this awesome chicken fajita. <gasps> Can't get more positive vibes than this, right? Positive vibes for your stomach, that's what I say. Okay, oh gosh, there's everything in here. Guacamole, sour cream, beans, we put everything in life. Roll it up and eat it. Oh my god. Mm. Guys, it's so good. Sour cream, avocado, the tomatoes. Mm. It really blends well. I'm gonna add some of the Baja sauce. Mm. Wow, RJ, wow. I'm gonna the hot sauce. A sprig of cilantro. I love that it's so fresh, like it's a fresh ingredient. Mm. Love it. Yeah, that's considered hot. Yeah. It's got spice. In my mind, it's more of a high medium. Mm. Oh my gosh. Mm. RJ, how's your taquitos? Really? Mm. Very crispy. Mm-hmm. I like it. It's like Shanghai. Chicken Shanghai. RJ, have a fajita. OMG guys. This food is delicious. Winding down to the last bite of chicken and guacamole. Put some Baja sauce on it. Wait, I need a sprig of sprig of cilantro. Yes. Now it's ready. Mmm. 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 Oh my gosh, wow. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, Mexico. Oh. Mexicans, you know how to eat. Or Americans, rather. Maybe this is Americanized Mexican food. Still so good. Mm. Mm -hmm. That chicken burrito gets five Mabuhay stars. Just so flavorful, juicy, fresh. Interesting, it says, food cannot be made at microwave speed. I like that. And then it's got like nutritional info of like black beans, you see that? There's like a health aspect to this place called Baja Fresh Mexican Grill. Muscle builder, protein helps build lean muscle. Yeah, okay. Interesting, never frozen steak and chicken that is hormone free and all natural. Oh wow. Guys, we're in Ross. 
RJ wants to go shopping. They have really good deals at Ross from our understanding, especially the Ross in Guam. That's where we first realized how awesome shopping is at Ross. Okay, bags. Guys, speaking of which, it is so easy to return things in North America. <laughs> Seriously. They're like, look, they've got a returns and exchange line. In the Philippines, it is so hard to exchange things or like return things. Like, forget it. You've bought it. They're just, it's so much trouble. They don't make it easy for you to make returns. I mean, generally. RJ's looking for presents. Pasalubong? Yeah, he's looking for Christmas presents. Wow, RJ, who are you planning on getting a bag for? As a Christmas present, it's probably for his sisters. Oh, wow, Kinder Surprise. RJ, did you have these as a kid? Kinder Surprises? No. RJ doesn't know this. Okay, guys, Kinder Surprise. But I wonder if this day and age, the toys are as cool as they were before. But oh, it's such an awesome product. RJ, are they expensive or cheap here? Yeah, it's cheaper compared to like buying it uh, like in the Philippines. It's cheaper here than in the Philippines? Oh, the name brands you mean. I see. Wow, they got furniture. You see that beddings? They got car stuff here. Look at this, like fold up chair. It's like Frank McCormick plaid. <laughs> Oh, I like this. Oh, here we go. Pet supplies. This makes me want to have a pet so I could have these supplies. <laughs> Seriously. Oh, wow. So nice. I wonder how easy this is to DIY. Things like this. Hmm? What do you guys say? Wow. Love it. Dogs, cat stuff. See that? You got puppy clothes, books, arts and crafts stuff. Wow, there's everything here. You got paintings. You see that? So nice. All right, here we are in kitchenware. <gasps> Plates. Oh, maybe RJ can buy his fine china here at Ross. Guys, I feel like I'm sneaking up on wildlife. There's RJ. He has no idea we're filming him. Let's hunt the RJ through the tall grasses, aka these clothes. Let's hide behind this man. What? You should go now. Okay, RJ wants me to leave. He wants to shop in peace. I know the feeling. Every time we're in Kartamar, I feel the exact same way. OMG, I was just walking back to the hotel. And guys, look at this living wall of ficus pumila. <gasps> awesome. It grows everywhere. Like I see this usually in the Philippines, but I guess ficus pumila can grow anywhere. Oh, love the palm trees. All right, guys, here at the hotel doing some work online. And I just wanted to say this Los Angeles trip is so awesome. So this is our last full day here in LA. RJ and I really enjoyed, although a lot of it was just sleeping. It's possible to enjoy sleeping, trust me. RJ and I, I think I just realized how hectic this year was for us. And we feel it the most every time we like travel and have like a workation, I guess. Because we end up just like sprawled on the bed the whole night, sleeping till whenever. It's kind of a nice break. Don't we all need a break? So, uh, love the US. Los Angeles, you guys have been amazing. All of the people we ran into in the streets, out when we were partying. I didn't really vlog too much because I also wanted to be present with RJ like while we were like going out and, and enjoying Los Angeles. So we vlogged a lot, but we didn't vlog everything. Um, but all of you guys who are in the vlogs, who um, happen to come up to us on the street, who aren't in the vlogs, thank you so much for being so cool. You Los Angeles people, People, seriously, I don't even need to explain that we're vloggers because you know like people notice when people have gadgets here in Los Angeles Which um, I found really cool. We don't have to explain. Yeah, I make videos for YouTube and then that weird conversation like oh What is that? Blah, blah, blah. You can make money. Blah, blah, blah. We don't need to explain that. They just know that here, which is uh, really cool So yeah, been an amazing trip um, But I uh, can't wait to get back home. I believe by the time you guys are watching this the next day is RJ and I's seventh year anniversary. Oh my gosh. Yesterday I was like, RJ, can you believe we made it to seven years? Crazy. It's been quite the journey, let me just say. Um, as all of you guys who are in relationships, long-term long relationships know, all relationships need like nurturing and work. It's an ongoing project. <laughs> But yeah, so we decided like that day, we're just gonna relax and chill as well. Um, but I'm looking back. I, I think we might either be on the plane on the way back to Manila um, or we might be landed now. Either way, stay tuned for the vlogs, okay guys? We're gonna go into 2020 with positivity, high hopes, forgiving of the past and being excited for what's up ahead. Yeah. Oh my, what did you get? <laughs> Secret. Don't That's open a it. Bit, are we gonna fit that in the suitcase? Oh, yeah. I'll try. I only paid $400 for everything, I think. 
Oh my. Excuse me, only paid $400? Oh, that's a, that's a, a big beans, amount. So it would cost a lot, like maybe triple. All right. Okay, guys, here begins the giant project that will happen like all night long until we leave. RJ's gonna start packing. He doesn't want me to get in the way. Trust me, you don't want to get in the way of RJ and packing. Or else. <laughs> All right guys, it's the last night here in LA, yes. And we're going to try to make the most of it. You know what I'm saying? Don't want to get too crazy because we got a flight to catch early in the morning. Oh, but uh, tonight's going to be a lot of fun. 